Hey y'all, I'm Kimberly here in Austin, Texas, and over the last several months, I've had the privilege of serving on the discernment team that was tasked with selecting the suffragan bishop candidate. We have narrowed it down to Brian Wallace. We are excited to put Brian's name forth to the diocese um, as the candidate has been selected. Brian went through a process of interviews with both Bishop Todd and then also with the discernment team, and we are really excited about Brian as a candidate about a few specific things especially that he can offer to this role. We are looking for someone who would really complement Bishop Todd, who had some similarities in leadership, but also some differences. We are also really looking for somebody who could specifically bring just like organizational expertise and systems expertise to the diocese, knowing that that is something that we want the diocese to grow in and be formed in. And we believe that Brian has this experience just through years of work in InterVarsity and with Fuller Seminary. And so we are excited that on April the 29th, there will be a special diocesan convention in which um, delegates will be voting on whether or not Brian should move forward as the candidate for the election in the College of Bishops. We are at the point now where Brian's background check is done, where the executive leadership team has unanimously agreed that Brian is the person to move forward with. And so as we proceed in this process, and especially as we move closer to um, April the 29th in this vote, and then assuming Brian moves forward in the process, September the 9th, he, when he will be consecrated, we just ask that you pray for this process. We ask that you pray for wisdom and discernment for clergy and other delegates who will be voting on the 29th of April. We also ask that you pray for Brian and for his wife, Lisa, as they um, just navigate this pretty significant shift in Brian's vocation and calling and in their life together. Um, in Lisa's life, Lisa um, is a spiritual director and has always worked closely with Brian and the things that he does. We ask too that you just pray for favor and that there are just um, continues to be just a smooth process and that those who um, are a part of the diocese and the convention on the 29th especially just feel a real excitement and a clarity um, in this process and around Brian as a candidate. Thanks, y'all.